All right, all right, all right. Howdy, folks. It's Handsome. And today, you're going to hit that like. You're going to hit that subscribe. You're going to leave a comment. We got something unbelievable, unattainable, unimaginable. We got the brand new Sony A7 V. Long awaited. I mean, why would they store it with back? I mean, come on. Don't throw this away. I usually throw everything away. We're gonna save that to put back. Yeah. This has been rumored for months. I mean, super months. Oh, wow. Definitely feeling a little heftier. The A7 V, people. First glance, first feel, I'm thinking A7 R5. It's got the same articulating screen as the 5, not the 9. I think the 9 does a little, I don't know. Definitely different. I would have stored it like this. First one's still the fast one course. Now, one thing I did notice is they finally started rounding out the grip because on the four and the three, it goes to a point. And to me, that does not feel comfortable. But this feels a little more comfortable. It's still awkward. Got a little dip right there. Oh my goodness. The sensor looks like a sensor. That thing is massive. Only a few people would get that. Super cool. Don't really know the specs on this thing. 33 megapixels. Ibis rated at 7.5. Five in the center. What does that mean? Blackout free continuous shooting at 30 frames a second. That's pretty crazy. Figurable pre bus capture up to one second. Okay. 4K 60p derived from 7K capture. 4K 120 with 1.5 crop. Man, we can't get away from this crop on this 120. It's got a new processor. The sensor is paired with the new Bion's XR2 processor, bringing the Sony most up-to-date autofocus system to the A7 line. whoop de doo Pre-burst. Pre-bursting. Partially stacked CMOS. Oh, yeah, the 4 was a, a backside integrated sensor. This one's partially stacked. But, hey! Let's get off of the specs. Let's get off of that. We are going to be the first to release a teardown video, breakdown video. And I want to take this apart. I want to see what the insides look like. Let me see you naked. Ow! All right, enough of the funny business. Right. Let's, uh... Let's get to taking apart. Tools, I'm using my toolkit. My stuff right there, handsomeshop.com. Check me out, know what I'm saying? Gonna add some more stuff hopefully in 2026 if I can get around to it. If not, hey, maybe next year. Let's get to taking apart. Yeah, we gotta be really careful because uh, this definitely is not supposed to be happening. Y'all don't tell anybody that I'm releasing this video, please. If you know me, you know I'm not that careful. I just. Like a bull in a china shop. Ooh. Good old Loctite. It's a good sign. Good sign. All the same size screw. Okay. First one that just doesn't pop off. Am I missing something down there? Well, let's get to taking off this bottom plate. I'm only, oh. The end pieces are the same all right all the base plate screws are the same this makes it a little easier for me all right let's oh let's be mo careful fresh leatherette oh they put some silver screws right there are all the same all right there's that oh wow they used to have a metal piece going all right here now when you look at that it's as plastic as it gets y'all digger 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 taken after the a93 and then look at that base plate all right Let's keep it going. Good screws, good screws. How many screws we got in there? Just one again. Boom. Goes on the inside. 
Oh, she finally fell. Cool. Yep, that is the board. Both of those. Looking pretty similar to the... Four. All right. Got two of them things, man. This is. I got a whole new. Oh! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! I don't say this often, but shout out to Sony. They did the sensor flex cables push down. Oh my gosh, let's let's give them a round of applause. Uh, man, they're making life easier for me because I'm Sony certified. <laughs> Fired. All right, man, hold up. Still got two screws over here. Let's see, pretty sure. Since I got the leather red up, let's go ahead and Remove this top cover. Boom. Trying to be as careful as possible. I'm definitely intrigued. Like... Heavily intrigued, might I say. Let's talk about OCD. Let's talk about you and me. All right, we got that first one. I wonder if that guy is going to be part of the top cover equation. Different flex cable for that and an orientation for the top cover. Oof, it's different. I don't know. I think that does go with the top cover, y'all. All right, so these cables do Ooh. right we're gonna set you right there they got the flex cable going under there that's that's different and it's exposed too that's wild usually there's like a bracket in there top cover not reusing parts on that one check out this really fast definitely not reusing parts here you're not all the way flat oh, those four screws first time this has no screws they usually at least put one but they don't need it now should we keep going duh I want to see <gasps> I think it's a different shutter. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. I wanna get to the shutter. I mean, with this new high frame rate, I really hope Sony used different shutters. I really hope they did. For their sake, because if not, they're cooked, bro. Like, I'm gonna. Now I did notice there's a piece of tape that is overlapping a flex cable and this bracket. If you did not catch that, then you will rip that flex cable, bruh, upon removal. And I don't want that for anyone. That's why we're taking it apart here together forever. Or at least until I die. All right. Boom.
All right, we still got that guy in the motor drive over there. That's cool. Got three screws on this thing now. I'll put you over there. It just looks cool, bro. Like, look at the little cities. <laughs> wow, that is just cool. All right, different orientations here. Okay, what are y'all for? A lot of bracketeering. Bracketeering, you're going down, Sony. You're bracketeering. So far, I'm digging it. I'm digging on you, you digging on me. All right, I'm fired. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry, just looking in awe. All right, drum roll, please. See what this sensor looks like. Wow. The 11th of October, 2025. I don't know how accurate that is, but... Ooh, it is a little different. That is... Man! I ain't gonna lie, that's cool, man. That's cool. I know, I know, I know. It's against my religion. Uh, take the shims off. Call my my shim, and I I I, I need you. We're taking the other shim off. Now, first and foremost, that that is a different motor drive. Looks like a shutter from an R series. Let's get into this most detrimental part. Is the Sony A7 V going to have massive shutter issues like all Sony's? Except the R series. I don't get a lot of the R series. But the A7 IV, I have made a lot of money off of those repairs. All right, the flex cable for the motor drive is sitting. This is going to be different. Boom. I don't know if that was intentional. Am I going to have to... Okay, you still got your... I can see those having issues. Still got your gap right there. Dun dun dun! Not a 3360, that's for sure. I wish John was here. I could show him real quick. I'm gonna send him a picture real quick.